Hello, not going to make this intro too long, but I want to first and foremost thank everybody who, who uh, watched the last video, Ocean's uh, Hillsong United. It was a really nice song. I got a lot of good feedback from a lot of my friends on, on Facebook, and I got a couple of comments here on YouTube. I received some requests for the next future videos, and I am happy to, to take a listen to those songs. One of the requests was, uh, or suggestion I should say, was made by a friend of mine named Omero, Omero Guerrero. Uh, shout out uh, a band called delirious he didn't really specify a song but i picked one at random which is uh, called majesty here i am i picked a live version because uh, sometimes studios tend to add things to performances and you're not sure if it's the band or if it's the producer just adding his little flair so here is uh, the band delirious with uh, majesty here i am okay nice little groove started right away Okay. Ooh, I like I like how clean that bass sounds. Very nice, nice and clean. No effect. There go the violins again, which I said in the last video. I love. Well, that was a chord I wasn't expecting. I was not expecting that chord progression, it's really nice. It's got a nice mellow voice. Bass is very is like carrying the whole song practically. I like it. Nice. Words are nice. I feel like it could be stronger there, more powerful, but maybe it's coming later. Nice simple beat. Nothing too, too crazy.
Every everything is very quiet, very subtle. It's, uh, except for the baseline, the baseline is okay. I just feel like there could have been more to that little bridge, but okay. Maybe a guitar solo or something. I like the lyrics. Your grace found me just as I am. Yeah, everybody singing back, the crowd singing back, which is awesome. Yeah. the quiet part, it's gonna build to something, hopefully. Okay. To every musician's dream. It becomes, a, it becomes an interaction, a, a communication between the audience and the, and the musicians. It's like you're giving and then they give back. It's beautiful. Okay. Brought his voice down. No build up this time. Okay, cool. All right, so a couple of things about this song. The drum beat was very steady. I like I like the drum beat. The keyboard player was doing a lot of the beautiful harmonies, just adding adding to the to the song. The bass line carried, I think, the most weight. That little bass line was pretty pretty awesome. I mean, it was it was simple, but but it carried it carried its weight. The guitar was very subtle. I, I heard some pieces where it would sing, it would play the same melody as the singer was was singing. You know, the vocals, nothing too impressive about it, really. To be honest, I mean, it was subtle. This was very like '90s, uh, early 2000s. I don't know when this song came out, but it it had that whole like uh, early 2000s vibe. So I guess we can we can look it up and see when it came out. Honestly, nothing too impressive about this this song maybe there's another song you guys can uh, suggest by delirious that's maybe a little bit more um, full i guess you could say i i think i'm gonna have to give this song three three stars i hate i hate to do that but three stars just there was no build-up there was no real i think that some parts really lack energy um and then there was nothing there in that bridge for me really you know sometimes there's like a guitar solo or some other offbeat or some other rhythm that takes that isn't the, the the original rhythm or beat of the song that takes you somewhere else and then it brings you right back to the uh, majesty uh, but there was nothing really so I, I, I gotta say I wasn't too impressed by this band but I still give them a three because the musicians seem like they know what they're doing obviously they, they seem like really great musicians but three stars for me this for this song all right well, that's it. That's it for this song. I thank you so much for joining me. Please remember to subscribe and hit the little bell button because I'm going to be doing a lot more of these uh, more often so uh, I, so you can get a notification when, when I post these. Um, I will see you on the next one.